Star Wars, the Black Series, Holiday Collection. Good to know. Hello, welcome to the final video for Happy Christmas 2022. This evening, we're taking a look at the complete, I believe, I hope, <laughs> Hasbro Star Wars, the Black Series, Holiday Collection. Brought to us by multiple retailers like Hasbro Pulse, uh, Target, Walmart, and a couple others. I'm going to let you do the research like I had to do to figure it all out. That was part of the fun of getting these. It was uh, a nice uh, holiday hunt, if you will. And uh, I did use for two. Let's start with the one that I got first, the one that drew my attention right out the gate, the protocol droid. Protocol Droid Holiday Edition comes with a little buddy. Got this uh, suave scarf here. I love the green and white stripes on the boots there. Let's take a close look at this one package and then that will give you an idea of how all of these are laid out. slice and we'll peel that out keep the crease safe I'm only going to record one unboxing here the rest I'll get the figures out so you guys can spend more time with your loved ones of course <laughs> there he is oh man wow let's get the cover shield off they just shine all right looking good mr. protocol droid now is this 3PO maybe I need to do a happy debate is the holiday droid C-3PO? We'll spin around there. Articulation will vary. Some uh, characters will probably have double knees. Uh, some will have double elbows. He's got uh, good ankles there. Oh man, I just want little curly Q elf shoes on the end with a little green uh, puff ball on the, on the front. Oh man, how cool would that be if these eyes lit up? Hello, I am C-3PO and I guess I'll have to do what you say. <laughs> if there was some extra paint in there on those wires, it would have been nice. Now this is molded red. If they would have hit this with a red metallic paint and made him, you know, the premier star of the collection, pearlescent this, you know, metal this up, man. He would have been the star, the star figure to chase. Let's take a look at some others and then let's uh, get group photos and all that fun stuff. Oh, let's do a comparison too at the end. That'd be fun. One thing I want to point out is I was about to set him down. Uh, there is no joints in these arms here, uh, so you've only got the single knee bend and uh, barely a barely a wiggle here. Pretty much like the actor had to work with uh, in real life. So kind of cool. The hand does have some uh, a really nice uh, pivot lock and rotation. He got all his articulation in the wrist, as they say. It's all in the wrist. Okay, diving into the order in which I acquired these. Hooky Holiday Edition. <laughs> Comes with a little pork bud. Beep, beep, beep. I don't really understand what's going on with the uh, with the colors on the bow. I like the blue hands. Let's get this guy out. On the subject of energy casters. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna go with uh, not not a hunter's orange, but I'm gonna go with power cord extension cable orange. Putting this together, if you've never done one of these before, uh, note the shape here on the attachment nubbin. You want to match that with the hole on the attachment nubbin. You can see it's not perfectly square. And it goes like that. And then it'll go right on. If it doesn't go right on, you're doing it wrong. If it doesn't go wrong, you're doing it wrong. If it doesn't go on, you're doing it wrong. Doesn't go on, doing it wrong. Let's fire this sucker. <laughs> Let me introduce you to one of my favorite blow dryer, hair dryer. It heats up action figures' hands. Those stubborn hands that are pretty stiff and difficult to get weapons in. This one's got a lot of chunky plastic on there. And now that they're warmed up, let's see how they move. Let's see how this one is stubborn. And with that hand, you can just literally open up the fingers and drop this right in there. Voila, here he is out of the package, the Holiday Wookiee. I'm gonna use my hand elevator. 
going up. <laughs> Stupid. Here he is from the side. And here he is from the back. But he's not wearing pants, so... Uh-huh. For the kids. And there's the bottom of his feet. As an aside, we will go over all of the little buds that each figure came with, but I'm going to do that after the big figs. Next up, I got the Mandalorian. Mandalorian warrior. That sweater is for the wind. And he's got a little bud. There he is. Mandalorian Holiday Edition. Great detail in that sweater. Cool mask. Helmet. Jetpack. All one color. This guy's got a strong suit. I'm fine with that there's no, like, weathering, no paint chipping. You know, these guys serve a purpose. They come out once a year, and they do their thing. These are set up to do that thing really well, and I bet when you get them all together, <laughs> they do it extremely well. <laughs> with this pretty cool energy weapon. Power strip uh, orange there. There it is. Okay, good rocker. He has uh, open holsters there, so he doesn't come with any blasters to put in there, but you could tuck some in from another Mando figure. There's also a peg here on the, on the rifle. Somewhere if you made a hole. Or if you know where it goes, leave a comment down below. I just warmed the left hand and I just wanted to show how easy it was to get around there if you uh, warm it up real quick. The next figure I picked up and added to the collection. This was about the time when I decided to go all in. The phase 2 Clone Trooper. The gingerbread version. He's the, he's the only gingerbread version, and uh, I like that they did that. Uh, it look, might look kind of plain, but um, he, he plays a part. You know, he gives it that contrast. He helps break it up. I'm excited to get this one out. This this was one of the, the first ones uh, that, I, that I really, really wanted, but I held off on him until I could make sure that basically what happened was, long story short. I got the droid, and then I was in a... A store, uh, which I will leave secret, and the Wookiee, the white Wookiee was there, and he just jumped out at me, and I said, wait, what? And I didn't even know he existed at the time, and I grabbed him, and I said, okay, at this point, I'm, I'm all in on this collection. <laughs> <laughs> and here he is, Phase 2 Clone Trooper Holiday Edition. Gingerbread boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Too much fun. <laughs> Love them, hate them. <laughs> they are what they are, right? <laughs> I dig them. I like doing holiday displays, though. I'm kooky. Like a cookie. <laughs> Home Slice here. Got the, um, let's call this, instead of calling it Power power Strip Cord Orange, let's call it Safety Orange, because when you see this one, you're like, oh, okay. It It's like a Nerf gun. Okay, I just warmed up the hand, and I'm going to put that right in there. I decided to make my gingerbread clone a lefty, because... I like diversity in my displays. Hey, you can't be in here. Get out of my kitchen. Those are my cookies. Next up, a First Order Stormtrooper Holiday Edition. Well, I love what they did with the with the webbing there. That is a Nerf blaster. <laughs> First Order Stormtrooper out of the box. They're getting better. The, as I go down through here, uh, the paint on this one is great. Love the two-tone on the gloves there. Uh, I thought it was interesting choice when I was looking at him when I originally got him that they didn't go with black on the helmet. You know, it's got that Grinch look to it, you know. By going with this darker green, this shade of green, because you, you add black to something to shade it and you add white to tint it. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but that's what I was taught in my art college. <laughs> oh boy, the presents! <laughs> these uh, these lower legs, I love the candy stripes that they did on the shins. Who's ever uh, art direction call that was, tie that in as a theme ac across these uh, cats. Great call on that. One of the design choices, the design cues that, that brought me in to get the whole collection was when I saw that multiple figures had the, the can had stripes down there. Different color stripes, but stripes nonetheless. Helps tie it all in, so nice job. A little articulation here. Double knee. The thigh cut, yeah, we got a thigh swivel in there. Waist swivel, roll around, get ahead, 
Not much confused Stormtrooper, but <clears throat> single elbow, swivel at the elbow, swivel at the wrist and all that good stuff. And does the wrist go out and in and out and in again? It does, it does, but it's hindered here by the armor a little bit. Good for standing around and posing for holiday pictures, I say. Rockers in the feet, pivot up, pivot down, and in the arms here. You can go all the way around, you can go out, get a T-pose. Yeah, this piece is removable. It can attach here or detach it. So if you want to army build these guys, you can set them up a little differently. And I give a strong recommend for heating this up uh, and sliding that back in. And what you want to do is you want to go in top and then, and then turn. If you try to come up underneath, you'll just be in a world of hurt and you'll never get it in there. So going from the top, heat it up, and then uh, you won't snap that attachment piece off because that is something that could snap. So there is a slot on the right thigh armor to attach his blaster. And there is the nubbin that you're gonna put in there. <clears throat> if you don't know, now you know. Ho, ho, ho. Something else I noticed, if you're having difficulty with your stormtrooper standing up and falling over, make sure that you've got these knees all the way into the standing position. If this one is cocked like so, he will fall over on you. You just want to lock that in there and then he should stand just fine. Okay, here is where my uh, a degree of uh, collector stress started to uh, take shape. <laughs> Snow Trooper, holiday edition. By going with the green and red, I think it it's it's odd but for me it, it still sells imperial right it still says empire this guy's crushing it for me <laughs> so no paint on the backpack so uh solid green is what you get but a nice green it is he's 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 boots with the fur in it <laughs> like the red on the gloves here star of the show that mask translucent energy blade there minor candy cane stripe just minor so it's not too goofy and he'll hold that just fine you can even two-hand it if you want to uh i love the the black galoshes uh, for the club uh, for the snow <laughs> the club <laughs> well it is a holiday party right isn't it? why not <laughs> okay getting down to the wire two to go the second to last black series star wars holiday edition that i got was my favorite trooper, the scout trooper. He's got that Mando deco style, so he's wearing you sporting the ugly sweater with Baby Yoda. I mean Grogu. <laughs> what? Fashionably late. Am I right? Man, this guy's rocking it. The strap on the leg that holsters his uh, uh, pocket nerf. He's got that cool torso swivel. Great range of motion in the neck. Looking down, checking the gas on his bike. Where's my keys? All the armor. Solid red back. Rockettes kick. Well, not quite. He doesn't have a drop down, so he can't get it up, but there's the bottom of the boot for you. Incredible range of motion in those double elbows there. This guy is ripe for uh, sitting in a G.I. Joe, The Havoc. Yo, Joe! <laughs> I would have loved to see what a version of this looks like with a, a white visor around here, or white mat, uh, 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 excuse me, frame, or a white mask, mask in here. As is, it looks like Matt Tracker's Trump mask. Do you hear me, Hasbro? Matt Tracker's mask! Who's got such super vision? Last but definitely not least, the figure that arrived, I acquired last. last. It's the mighty figure that the can Santa save style the day. Range Trooper. When I saw this one, I put a lump of coal in my pants. Surprise, he's got frosted boots. What? What? What kind of weapon is that? Does this weapon go for a transformer? Come on now, you gotta put in packing transformers weapons in now with your Star War. <laughs> Yeah, dude! Look at 
Oh, I'm glad the face isn't just see. See, when you add a little bit of paint to the helmet, like they could have done for the Biker Scout. Oh, oh, oh. So I wanted to know what it would look like. That's what it looked like. Man. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm. Mm, mm. This guy might beat, beat, might beat out my Biker Scout for favorite one. But if he does, that's okay because I still have the Biker Scout. We still have each other. Don't get jealous now. I see you down there getting jealous talking about me. And there they are. I'll get a better shot for you in a moment, but this is them at the bottom of your screen. If you'll notice, <laughs> at the bottom of your screen, there is the uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Who do we appreciate? Star Wars, Star Wars, uh, Holiday uh, Edition. Uh, 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 holiday Edition. And you just missed a couple of them bite the dust. Another but, one bites uh, the dust. That, that regardless, we're, we're pretty much done here. What I want to get to is some really cool pictures. And uh, let's see. Uh, what else did I want to do? I wanted to... Yeah! You know what I almost forgot? With people biting the dust and here, you know who hasn't gone. bit the dust? And you know what you haven't seen? All of the little buddies that they all come with, the little butt buds and creature buds. Let's check them out now. This one came with the protocol droid. His head swivels. He likes to look down when you stand him up. It's the best way to get him to balance, I found, unless I'm doing it wrong. Cute. The hookie comes with the Cute little pug, he's so cute with the little pug with the little scarf. The mommy, the pug, they got a scarf on him and his little blue feet. Mando came with this one because reasons. I imagine all the deco hits and everything that he comes with. The, so, you know, scale back on this one. But, oh yeah, the tail comes off. You get the symbol of that tail there. And he can. Uh, hop, hop, hop. Gingerbread Trooper comes with this little pug. First Order Trooper comes with <laughs> Snow Trooper comes with this Borg who wins the Scarf Award. Scout Trooper comes with Grogu. And that will fasten there. Down there. Can the head move? It can. The head can rotate. Cool. Cute. He's so cute. And Range Trooper comes with the uh, wheel rolling. Reindeer droid. What was the guy's name? Dio? Was that his name? Now we can do some pretty pictures. Come on, come on. See photos of all holiday Star Wars figures on my Instagram at happy underscore accident. All right, it's my favorite time. Comparison time. Holiday Scout Trooper is going to represent for the uh, whole group here. Um, excuse me? I believe you guys are in the wrong photo shoot set. So you and me, we're, we're cool, right? Hey, hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, dude? I like the sweater. Yeah, pretty cool, right? So what's up? Did you get laser tag for Christmas? Come on, man. Let's play. I gotta get a game, man. I gotta get one. I am Holiday Optimus Prime. You too, huh? Say nice blaster. Hey, now. Check you out. Man, that is one snazzy outfit. Hey, how'd you dodge the holiday treatment? What is going on there? Is he is he hunting other Wookiees? Is he hunting Sasquatch? What's going on there? <laughs> we'll get a Nerf gun that look just like this. It'd be white and have an orange safety tip on it, and it'll say Phase Two Clone Trooper. Oh, and I'm probably lying about the order that I got him in. I'm trying to remember. I think this is it, <laughs> and you probably don't even care about that. It'll do, little Stormtrooper. It'll do. Okay, here's where my uh, oh 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 oh. If you had if I if this somebody said okay, you can only have one in your collection. This is it. This is the one. Uh, a missed opportunity. He should have had a holiday bow that he can uh, straighten. Am I right? Uh uh. Happy holidays, everyone. Merry Christmas and thanks for playing. See you later. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And don't forget to turn notification bells on and share the video because that's the best way for stuff to do with the thing. And don't forget. Uh, I touched it. <sighs>